So parallax is basically two things seeing the same thing from a different angle. So let's say you want to take a picture of your buddy over here. And uh, so that's, that's your slightly weird looking buddy. Now, let's say for instance, that here's your lens. Here's your viewfinder. The viewfinder is going to see the scene this way. Your lens is going to see the scene this way. So if you line up your viewfinder to take a picture of your buddy and you're trying to get him, actually your, your viewfinder is going to see it a little bit more like this. So if you're trying to line up a shot where your buddy takes up your entire frame, you can do that right here by adjusting for parallax. Let's talk about how the range finding mechanism actually works. So if you were to take apart your camera and see the range finder, there would be a mirror here and a mirror here. Here's the viewfinder, the eye glass you look through. Here's a window and here's a window, okay? And again, we've got, you've got your buddy over here and you're gonna take a picture of him. So the light from your, from your friend comes into your eye this way, okay, through that mirror. But it also comes in this way through that mirror, bounces over, and then up to your eye. And so the rangefinder works as you focus your lens, this mirror changes, and this is grossly, grossly exaggerated, but it changes its angle so that the light hitting it comes in at a different angle and goes to this mirror at a different angle. So in practice, what happens when you look through the viewfinder window, you will see two images overlaying each other. You'll see your primary image of your friend. And when it's in focus, this is what it will look like. If it's out of focus, it will look more like this. You'll see two copies of the identical image overlapping each other, and the more out of focus it gets, the further apart from each other the two images will become. And so you focus your rangefinder by adjusting the dial until both of the images overlap and you have a single image in your viewfinder.